Oh God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritu Sancto. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum. Amen. Alleluia. O Lord, eternal King and Son, forever at the Father's side, you fashioned Adam out of dust, and in your image he was formed. The devil snared him by deceit. In hatred for the human race, so from the virgin's womb you took, a human body, flesh, and form, that by your marriage with our flesh you might unite us all to God. Redeemer, you would pardon sin through gift of cleansing baptism. On our account you bore the cross, and willingly you chose to die. You gave your blood in sacrifice, the price of our salvation, Lord. Now you are risen, glorified, with glory from the Father's due, devoted minds and hearts believe that we through you shall rise again. O Jesus, before mind and heart, our everlasting paschal joy, and gather us reborn of grace to share your triumphs evermore. To you, Lord Jesus, glory be, who shine in victory over death, with God the Father ever blessed, and a loving spirit ever one. Amen. The night will be as clear as day. Alleluia. O Lord, you search me and you know me. You know my resting and my rising. You discern my purpose from afar. You mark when I walk or lie down. All my ways lie open to you. Before ever a word is on my tongue, you know it, O oh Lord, through and through. Behind and before you beseech me, your hand ever lay upon me. Too wonderful for me this knowledge, too high beyond my reach. Oh, where can I go from your spirit? Or where can I flee from your face? If I climb the heavens, you are there. If I lie in the grave, you are there. If I take the wings of the dawn and dwell at the sea's furthest end, even there your hand would lead me. 
Your right hand would hold me fast If I say let the darkness hide me And the light around me be night Even darkness is not dark for you And the night is as clear as the day Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. The night will be as clear as day. Alleluia. I know my sheep and my know me. Alleluia. For it was you who created my being, knit me together in my mother's womb. I thank you for the wonder of my being, for the wonders of all your creation. Already you knew my soul, my body held no secret from you. When I was being fashioned in secret And molded in the depths of the earth Your eyes saw all my actions They were all of them written in your book Every one of my days was decreed Before one of them came into being To me how mysterious your thoughts the sum of them not to be numbered. If I count them, they are more than the sand. To finish, I must be eternal like you. Oh, search me, God, and know my heart. Oh, test me and know my thoughts. See that I follow not the wrong path. And lead me in the path of life eternal. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. I know my sheep and mine know me. Alleluia. His glory covers the heavens, and His praise fills the earth. Alleluia. Let us give thanks to the Father for having made you worthy to share the lot of the saints in light. He rescued us from the power of darkness and brought us into the kingdom of his beloved Son. Through him we have redemption, the forgiveness of our sins. He is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of all creatures. In him everything in heaven and on earth was created, things visible and invisible. All were created through him, all were created for him. He is before all else that is. In him everything continues in being. It is he who is head of the body, the church. He who is the beginning, the firstborn of the dead, so that primacy may be his in everything. It pleased God to make absolute fullness reside in him, and by means of him to reconcile everything in his person, both on earth and in the heavens, making peace through the blood of his cross. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. His glory covers the heavens, 
and his praise fills the earth. Alleluia. Jesus, because he remains forever, has a priesthood that does not pass away. Therefore, he is always able to save those who approach God through him, since he forever lives to make intercession for them. It was fitting that we should have such a high priest, holy, innocent, undefiled, separated from sinners, higher than the heavens. Unlike the other high priests, he has no need to offer sacrifice day after day, first for his own sins and then for those of the people. He did that once for all when he offered himself. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. When they saw the risen Lord, Alleluia, Alleluia. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. God sent his Son into the world, not as its judge, but as its Savior. Alleluia. Magnifica. Anima mea Dominum, et exultavit Spiritus meus, in Deo salutari meo. Quia respectit humilitatem ancile sue, et ceenem ex hoc beata medicent omnes generationes. Quia fecit mici mania qui potens est, et sanctum nomen neus, et misericordieus a progenie in progenies, timens ipus eum, fecit potentiam in brachio suo, dispersit superbos mente corti sui, deposuit potentes de sede, et exaltavit humil, Esuriente simplevit bonis, et divites dimisit in annis. Suscepit Israel puerum suum, recordatus misericordiae sue, sicut locutus est ad patres nostros, Abram et seminieus in secula. Gloria patri et filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. God sent his Son into the world, not as its judge, but as its Savior. Alleluia. In his Son, risen from the dead, God has opened for us the way to everlasting life. Let us ask the Father, through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. God of our fathers, you raised your Son, Jesus, from the dead and clothed him in glory. Move our hearts to complete repentance, that we may walk in newness of life. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. You have led us back to the shepherd and bishop of our souls. Keep us faithful under the guidance of the shepherds of the church. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. You chose the first fruits of Christ's disciples from the Jewish people. Reveal to the children of Israel the fulfillment of the promise made to their forefathers. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. Remember the lonely, the orphaned, and the widowed, and do not abandon those who have been reconciled with you by the death of your Son. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. You called Stephen to your presence when he bore witness to Jesus standing at your right hand. 
Welcome our deceased brothers and sisters who in faith and love hoped for the vision of your glory. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. O God, life of the faithful, glory of the humble, blessedness of the just, listen kindly to the prayers of those who call on you, that they who thirst for what you generously promise may always have their fill of your plenty. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Dominus nos benedicat, et ab omni malo defendat, et ad vitam perducat eternam. Amen. Amen. 